What's going on, YouTube? Good morning. It's Metal Dead Fest coming to you live and direct. Here to give you my fave five plays for today's six game main slate. Today is the 31st of January. Hope everybody's having an amazing morning. Hope everybody's blessed. Be productive for this day. Let's jump into it, y'all. Feel free to smash that like button. Please subscribe. And if you don't mind, press that bell icon to get notified for future content. Let's go. Going to point guard. All right, now going to be looking at Reggie Jackson going against Dallas. All right, he's 4,700. Uh, he's 54 on FanDuel. Great spot. See the last three games. 40, 30, 29. Getting the minutes. Getting the usage as well. I'm loving this play. As you can see, playing against Dallas. The past two games that he's been um, at home. He's averaging 33 fantasy points. Definitely a great matchup. Reggie Jackson. All right. Dallas on the second game back-to-back. -back. They allowing an average 36.1 fantasy points to opposing point guards. Went away. Giving up about 39.1 fantasy points. Went underdog. This is a 2.5 uh, favor for Detroit against the, uh, Dallas today. So I'm plugging them in as my point guard play. All right. Now looking into the shooting guard spot. Now going to shooting guard. Going to go with this man, Lou. Williams going against LA Lakers, man. This is an in city narrative, man. Definitely want to look at him in this play. Look at the past three games. Um, he had a 50, he had a 54, and he also had another 53 phase point game. All right, when he was also, I think it was 2016. So definitely want to take a look, y'all, for Lou Williams. All right, he's been a perfect line of three games straight. All right, averaging 53 phase points in the past two games versus LA. He had a 50 phase point game at home this year. All right, so definitely want to take a look at Lou Williams and the smash and spot. 7,200 on DraftKings, 7,300 on FanDuel. It's a steal price. Plug him in. Enough said. All right, now going to my small forward spot. Now going to small forward, take a look at Aaron Gordon, y'all. This guy's been balling recently. He's one of those guys I be. It's, it's hard to get co consistent results with him, but as you can see, past three games 40, 43, 48. The minutes is there. The usage is there. Definitely gonna take a look at him going against Indiana. Look at this. The past five games 50, 47, 38, 35, 33. This guy is giving you value and more with this play. Aaron Gordon in a great spot today. Last game, like I said, at home versus Indiana. That was December 7th. All right, he had a 49 face point game in 34 minutes. Eight for, fifth, eight for 18 on the field. 14 rebounds that game. This is a 1.5 favor for them against Indiana tonight. All right, Indiana's on the second game back to back. They're now on an average only 27 uh, face points to opposing power forwards when underdog. But he's been averaging 42.9 face points at home in the past five games, getting about 40.3 face points when favored. Love him in this play on the shooting forward, I mean, uh, small forward, or if you want to plug him in, that's your power forward. Great spot, y'all. Plug him in. All right, so see if you draft dashboard tools in the link in my description. Click on the link, sign up now. It's only for 30 days, so definitely you want to check out these tools, y'all. You won't regret it. You get access to DraftKings or FanDuel. All right. Once you sign up, click on the menu bar. You have access to the NBA cheat sheet, all right, which gives you the top players of the slate for the top tier all the way to the value plays. Great to know. You got the sleepers, your studs. Click on the watch players. You have access to my plays. Watch Metal DFS picks. You see my plays. You can also use it to also plug in into the lineup optimizer, generate quality lineups. All right, so check it out right now. Also, you use the mass lineup generator, which generates up to 100 lineups with your custom plays. So, that's a great tool to see. Check it out, y'all. You won't regret it, like I said. One stop shop for your needs. All right. So, let's jump into my plays again. We're going to go to the power forward spot. Now, power forward, this guy's been balling. All right. We're going to go with Draymond Green. All right. Let's go to Draymond Green. Going against Philly. He loves playing Philly, y'all. This guy's been ball. Look at this. Past four games, 35, 49, 61, 48. He's at home. You know, it's going to be nationalized, you know, nationalized television, man. It's going to be, he's going to go off, man. He loves playing at home. 
uh, averaging 51.3 fantasy points in the past four games in the past four years versus Philly. Getting about 8.6 rebounds a game, 9 assists a game, about 2.6 steals and blocks combined a game in the past five games. Love him in this play. Draymond Green as my power forward for tonight. Love him. Plugging him in. 62 is a steal. 72 is still not bad. I still see about 35, 40 face point game. Hopefully around 45, but love him in this play. Good upside. All right. So going to my center spot today. All right. Got some couple spots, but... You know, one guy I'm looking at will be LaMarcus Aldridge. Even though, you know, uh, DeRozan could be coming back in today. I still love him, man. He's still been balling recently. 55, 55, 47 the past three games. All right. Also, check him out against Brooklyn. 52, 40, 42. Look at the past five games. You know, so he's look, doing real good. You know, he's playing like the way he should be playing, man. So, love him in this play. All right. But nonetheless, check him out. Averaging 59.3 fans points in the past five games at home. Getting about 53 fans points when favored. Getting about 26 points, 10 rebounds a game. Brooklyn's allowing an average 41 fans points when away. Giving up about 9.9 .9 rebounds a game with underdogs. Love him in this play. If you want to get some savings, it's a risky but a high reward spot. Not sure if if the coach is going to allow him play. If Pop going to allow him play for Paul. Paul is in a great spot. You know, look at him, man. 3,135 on FanDuel. Great spot, but look at him against Brooklyn. Past two games, 40-42. If he gets the time, man, he could smash the slate. But we don't know. I might get a couple lines with him just in case, man. So I'm going to plug him in and a couple of my lines. But Paul Gasol is in a great spot, y'all. Like, I had him last game. He only gave me one fancy point, man. But I still like him, man. He's one of those guys that could just, they give him minutes. Pop is the type of guy, man, that just hits you with some random stuff, man. And it works. But he, he plays for more so for the team aspect opposed to a player. So, yeah, I'm going to plug him in just knowing what he's capable of doing, man. So, I have a couple lines with him. But that, that's my fade five with a Paul Gasol bonus high risk. But definitely a good reward play. Like my plays, feel free to give me a thumbs up. Any questions or concerns with your lineup, feel free to comment below. I love y'all, man. Y'all collect that bag today. Y'all stay blessed. It's Mel DFS, and I'm signing out.